I'm saying it quietly, everybody in the house is awake, cause... We're going on holiday. What are we doing? We're going on holiday. We're going on holiday. So, let's get ready to go to the airport. I say let's get ready, we all woke up maybe 15 minutes ago. And she is ready for the plane. So we are going to set off now and let's go catch a flight. got in the room so I thought I'd do a little room tour so we've got bathroom look how cute the aesthetics is like I love this oh my god yeah love that and then just this cute little feel have a look outside. Oh, a little balcony. Cute. Why can we take the electrician out of England? <laughs> but not, is that the saying? Why have you always got to look at the electrical stuff? If I ever want a job in Tenerife. I may have one. <laughs> what are we getting? Lay's paprika. I want the Cheetos, but they haven't got the crunchy ones. So that's that thing. Might have to just go for the plain Lay's. Decisions. We have gone for a little walk and I've done the most worst thing that you could do i forgot my own shell anklet so i'm gonna get one of these because you cannot be on holiday without a shell bracelet first drink of the night is up we have got a chop oh i forgot what it's called a chocolate orange espresso martini what have you got French. So sure she drank. Drank. Is it a French? French martini. What's it? What's in a French martini? I have no idea. <laughs> but let's try this. Okay. Wow. I'm drinking these all night. This is so good. Try it. You're only allowed to try it because it's on camera. If not, I would be keeping it to myself. <laughs> Let's get the reaction. I always love Jordan's reactions of things. We, we, we either get the nod and the Churchill nod. There we go. <laughs> it's nice, isn't it? That's good. Okay, so me and Meg have gone for the pate with mixed herbs. And Jordan has got the mixed vegetable soup which actually looks real nice and Chris is as English as they come and won't eat anything other than chicken nuggets and chips. <laughs> 
Yeah, she nearly ordered just a side of chips. Yeah, he nearly just actually ordered just a side of chips for <laughs> the starter. <laughs> They're good. Give us your Churchill nod again. There we go. Okay, we're food stalking right now. I love how they're trying to make it so you feel like it's quite a premium steakhouse. I mean, the way she's cutting it looks a little bit tough, if I'm honest, but we'll see. We will see. Okay, Jordan, what have we got here? So this Beef is... and a suet steak and ale pie. A what? Suet steak and ale pie. Suet steak and ale pie and then that's fillet. Yeah, fillet steak. And then we've got some creamy peas, asparagus. Look at this. Are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, so we've just cut this steak and ale. Is it steak and ale? Yeah. Basically steak oh. and ale pie. Look how much meat is in there. This is insane food. Good morning. Oh my God. That's the first time I've spoke. <laughs> oh my God. Why is it that aircon always just kills you? So it's day two. Jordan, I think has been awake for like a good hour. I just heard the door go earlier. Um, and I've just looked at him on Find a Friend app, stalker and he seems to be sort of just heading back to the hotel now so he'll come back we'll go get some breakfast go wake up megan and chris and see if they want to come down and then we're just having a chill day today a chill day around the pool trying to get a tan and then we've got another dinner reservation tonight um i want to show you though how efficient this hotel is because they have got an app which has everything on it. Let me show you. So you get this, you get to download this app when you first turn here. So you've got live requests up here. So you can literally order people to come and collect your tray if you had room service, the room service, snacks menu, um, like literally everything. You can then go on to amenities and say if you need like more toilet paper, shampoo, dental stuff, extra body towel, etc. Then you have like general if you need like sewing kits and things like that. So that's really, really great. And then you can do the same for like housekeeping, laundry, maintenance. So like if something was broken, aircon, whatever, you can just do it all on the app. Then they've got a little map for you just so that you can see everything. The accommodations, about the property, preferred club. Like you can literally go on to everything. So you can see all of the different restaurants and it will sort of tell you what they are, where they are, when they serve from. And all of them then also have like the menu on as well. So my favourite part is the garlic. <laughs> Heavy on the c bread <laughs> i just love that but um yeah it's such a great little actual menu like you can just see everything so the app i'm very very impressed with i mean i've been to dubai and not even had an app before so we're loving that i think i might just order room service just for the fun of it really so you've got room service, the different bars, romantic packages. So you can basically order like either a romantic breakfast, romantic menu or dining with the stars. So I'm guessing it's like a little outsidey thing that you can do, which is cute. There's a spa. I think I'm going to book myself in here. I just feel like I need to release some tension, you know. So they've got loads to do and they do it like outside overlooking the sea which i think is really really cute so yeah i've been playing around with that and also so it will if you click on tonight's show it will show you like everything that was sort of like going on and then the activity shows you for like the gym so obviously i um accidentally forgot gym gear so this is a shame i'm not going to be able to use this part of the app 
accidentally but it sort of shows you as well like what times everything is which is really really great so yeah fully impressed with the little app but i'm gonna go get ready quickly for breakfast and go get some grub and we'll go see what the breakfast is like Jordan should be back in a minute from his little walk. So this is what I'm wearing for breakfast. I love these shorts. So I, oh, I forgot where I got them from. But the legs come out really, really wide. So they help give the illusion of little snatched waist and just make you look a little bit smaller. So yeah, this is the breakfast look. So we have got fresh honey, jams, pancake machines. Oh my God, look at those waffles. They are big waffles. With all your little syrups. There is not a single white plastic chair in sight, which I love. Oh my God, look at Jordan's face. I love Jordan around food. What is that? Churros for breakfast. Yeah, pizza. Churros, little mini pizzas, hash browns, pastries, babe. We've got the full fry up. I'm not sure who has zucchini. Zucchini, look at me saying it all American. Who has courgette? Oh, sweets, more pastry. <laughs> what are that? Oh my god, I thought they were mushrooms, they're little chocolate meringues. Oh, almond biscuit. Okay, let's go find the Prosecco. Ulavaza coffee station for you. Fresh. Got fruit and salad bar. Oh my god, you can have a roast pork for breakfast. Wow, this food actually looks so good. Got porridge. More breakfast bit. I never know how to say this. Is it Shakuto board? I think I've definitely said that wrong. But that chorizo looks insane. So we've got all of this. Got all your little jams. What else is around here? <laughs> Ham and cheese toasties. <laughs> cheese. Okay, this breakfast might have beat the one that we went to in, oh my god, can we do tequila shots in the morning? Babe, do you want a Bloody Mary? Yeah. <laughs> this might actually beat the breakfast that we had in Ibiza. I want these little cereal dispensers when you build me a pantry. Because you will build me a pantry, won't you? Yeah. Oh, what? Is that milkshake? So you can make chocolate milkshake? It's for your cereal. Chocolate milk on your cereal. <gasps> Is that pecans? Yeah. Yes. I love pecan plats. Oat milk, skimmed milk, oat milk, rice milk, almond milk, soy milk. Oh. A chocolate fountain. Okay, darling. Oh, wow. And you've got brownies. Aren't they those little coconut -y things? You can put all your fresh fruit then in there. Right, now we've looked for everything. What are you going to first? Bacon. Bacon. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, I didn't show you this part a minute ago. There was too many people. We've got a nice little bread station. Some fresh juice and then Prosecco. We're out for night number two. We're gonna try and head off to Hard Rock Hotel. Of course, we've got 
little seashells anklets because you cannot go on holiday without those i've got this cute little i always say it looks like a wine bag carrier from zara and then we've got the peri shorts and then a zara bodysuit i've got this cute little choker from asos and this is the outfit right this cow bag's just walked in <laughs> we've both got straight hair camo tops <laughs> and we both put heels on without no oh megan you're missing the anklet i can't put it on with these <gasps> megan don't go with these wow you've ruined the whole look oh, wow. as if we've just walked in like this <laughs> okay let's go <laughs> not broken i've just ran out of storage so we're on the phone and gonna vlog the rest of the holiday on there so we're just going for breakfast megan and chris are already there we're a bit tired this morning aren't I'm we very sleepy considering jordan was awake at like eight o'clock yesterday and you'd gone for a good hour and a half walk hadn't you that was like a typical dad on holiday thing to do so yeah off to find megan and chris i've already got us a table we have come to a little restaurant on the hotel complex. I've got this cute little crispy salad, crispy chicken Caesar salad. Jordan's got half a chicken. No, he's got half a hen. <laughs> half a hen. And then these two have gone for the classic cheese, what is it? Cheese fingers that they call them, the yes. chicken strips. <laughs> Are you happy? Yes. <laughs> this is tonight's little outfit it's from boohoo it's a two-piece so it's a nice little short set and then top i've just got my hair up because i could not be bothered to wash it tonight knowing that we're going to sign park tomorrow so did this and i have got oil all in the back of it because i went for a little massage just towards the end of the day it was very much needed so this is blurry this is tonight's look and we're going for a little um meal on the actual hotel tonight so just so that we can have an early night have some cocktails then on the sunset 
um, sort of bar up at the top and we'll go from there. So up here is called the Sunset um, Bar and it literally overlooks all of the sea. So we're gonna go up there for cocktails after. If we just go round here and we go out this little gate, then this is one of the other restaurants which we're going to this evening. In this sun, you can literally see where my head's burnt though. <laughs> Look how pretty. It's like open air. Jordan, of course, needed to come and see the lobster tank. I really wish I liked fish. Should we do a Tyson Fury and let them all back yeah. out into the sea? <laughs> Buy them all and then let them all out in the sea, do a Tyson Fury. They're so cool looking. Jordan, you really want a fish tank, don't you? Yeah. I don't know if I could eat them now. I've seen them alive. No. I think it's cruel. Look at that. This is a bit like gaucho, isn't it? When they show you all yeah. of the meats. That's huge. Are you going big boy steak tonight? What's this one? Premium. <laughs> I can't get over how pretty this is with it all being open. Oh my God, look at Megan's glass. I generally thought when it was coming over, it was like falling. I thought it was a Look how funny it is. All of the glasses upstairs in the cocktail bar are like that. Where are we going after this? Cheers. Cocktail bar up top. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay, okay so I got the lamb shoulder on, oh, I forgot what it was. Sweet potato puree. Jordan, what's yours? Veal cheeks. Veal cheeks. I'm not sure I'd eat that. Chris has gone very not well, I mean, it's the furthest thing away from chicken nuggets and chips that you could have got. Well, that grilled salmon. Grilled salmon. Meg has done the chicken nugget and chip dinner. <laughs> that burger does look insane. It is huge. This is us. So this is the cute little sunset bar at the top of our hotel. We were here a little bit too late, so we didn't actually see the sunset go down, but it's nice. Out the way, Jordan's managed to lose himself. This is like earlier today. You had to get a key to go through it, which we didn't have the key because we're not special enough. But Jordan's gone walking around here. I don't really know where he's gone. So let's go have a look. This was called the Preferred Club. So, I don't actually know where he's gone. But I mean, this goes on for ages. Oh, here he is. What's around there, George? Cool tiki beds. Oh, they're like little cabanas, aren't they? Oh, imagine sitting here and just looking out over that. Oh, these are nice. Yeah. Why didn't you put me in the preferred club? Now I feel like I'm in a peasant place. Oh, imagine just sitting there, look. And then this is what you're looking out over all day. So nice. You just really in this hotel don't think that you're in Tenerife until you walk out onto the street. 
but if you don't want to go out generally all of the restaurants and stuff are really nice inside that you wouldn't need to oh i just nearly fell over <laughs> oh yeah oh it's like a christmas tree jordan as soon as we get back jordan it's christmas and we're putting out that tree oh, christmas. <laughs> it is christmas are you excited for the christmas tree to go up when we get back no okay not coming down until december the uh, 12th mm, it is it goes up normally so my birthday is the 18th of october and then like first week no second week of november is when that tree's going up this year. We're not pushing it to December. I like to be happy and Christmas is my happy time. Stand on the hero, eh? oh, No, I don't want to stand under no, it's there. Just confetti. It's not confetti. Stand on the hero, please. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, that was silly, wasn't it? <laughs> Look how cute the, the little shower. Do we do the shower walk? Do, the, do you reckon they come on automatic? Surely that's automatic. Yes, that's what I'm making. Not even close to it, and that's not. Right, stop being silly. Let's go get our drinks. Um, Chris and Meg are there. Oh, our drinks are here. Hi, Chris. Oh, look at the tiki glasses. Why in the coconut glass? Okay, so Jordan's is in this coconut glass. These are what I want for the bar. Megan's got a white tiki, I've got a bamboo. Chris, oh, you got coconut too. Yeah. Good morning. What day are we on now? Fourth day. Three. Fourth day, Tuesday. We're going to Sion Park. What time is it right now? Like quarter to eight. We we're awake very early. We did try and have an earlier night last night, but we we're awake very early. None of us are happy. Look at Jordan's face, not happy. Megan's face, not happy. Chris, are you happy? Yeah. Oh, Chris is happy, but he's not happy about going to Sion Park because he's scared of heights and <laughs> he's already burnt. To a he Chris. Really got much going for him, He's not he? got much going for him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he is utterly burnt. There is no two ways around it. So he's going to have to be that kid at the water park with his t-shirt on today. How do you feel about having such white, delicate virgin skin? Uh, I think it's great. <laughs> We're going to have some breakfast and then get going. Right, Jordan has just gone and got a fruit platter. What have you got there, Jordan? Bananas, watermelon, and strawberry. Bananas, watermelon, and strawberry. Um, quite nice. Megan's nearly finished her fruit platter. Um, what did you have? Peach, melon, dragon fruit, watermelon. Bananas are ripe, are they? Mm. <laughs> yeah, quite juicy. Yeah, got a lot of sugar on. <laughs> Was there a big mix that you found? How's the watermelon? Juicy? Not much water. Not much water. <laughs> what you got left? Strawberry? Strawberry. Mm. Yeah, they're yeah, nice. Nice, nice and fresh. Nice and fresh. Pick this morning. Pick this morning. <laughs> Head underwater. I'm falling back into you. I thought we'd be smarter. I got nothing left to lose. You said you me. So it opens at 10 o'clock. It's 5 to 10. It's a pretty big queue. Oh, these faces aren't happy. <laughs> we'll see how long it takes. Okay, so we just realised that we were standing in the queue for people who have tickets. And actually, if we stood here, we're only like three people deep. So maybe don't buy your tickets beforehand. We've got Koi. I think down there is where the sea lion pits are. There's like a little sea lion part. But we're now going to go and get pull socks, pull socks, pull shoes. 
and the queue again is ridiculous. I think we just queued like 40 minutes for a locker and now we've got a queue probably for another half an hour. We've left Jordan in the queue somewhere. Now to go and get pool shoes. Oh, Chris, look, there's a duck. We are on the Lazy River. I've got a case on, so it's a little bit blurry, but quite busy. We've lost Meg and Chris, they're in front. We're just chilling, babe, aren't we? Found them. Oh, Megan's got my hat on, that cost me a euro, that did. <laughs> Look at our fancy shoes. I'm on my holidays, I'm not doing anything. Jordan is doing all the work. He is my servant. I am on holiday. <laughs> up with some white cowgirl boots i've only got a cream bag which is a bit of a schoolgirl error but we'll move so we're going out for a little italian tonight and this is look at this tiramisu cocktail Mine. i'm gonna be drinking these all night and then we have got garlic and cheese for catcher bread for starters. Apparently tonight we're just a table that orders carbonara. No, I'm different. Okay, Jordan doesn't like creamy sauces. So what have you got? Lamb ragu. Lamb ragu in tagliatelle. <laughs> this looks insane. Just waiting for my cheese that will never stop. Morning. I'm a bit tired today after the water park. I realised that you're not going to then really see much more of the other rides because I think you really sort of need like a GoPro. Um, like just trying to hold a phone whilst you're trying to hold on and not fall off of a ride. Like near death experience that would have been. So um, yeah, I kind of then just left the phone in the pool, in the pool, in the locker. But it's a really, really great park, isn't it? How did you find the park? Really good. What was your favourite? Uh, they were all pretty good to be fair. They were all pretty cool the rides. The ones, because obviously we went in a four, a lot of like the bigger rides are for four people. Chris, he... Um, Cried the whole time. He didn't cry, but he, there were some screams, wasn't there? Some mm -hmm. unusual sounds. So, but then we did see like children going on some of them. So. They were really good fun. It is a really, really good park. There's like little sea lions just as you walk in. Um, we bought the, what are they called? The water shoes. They were 10 euros each. And we didn't actually really need them because it was completely overcast yesterday, um, which was actually quite welcomed being that we were going to queue all of that time. But we got the fast pass and we got it for the afternoon which we were really happy about because the in the morning we just had time to go snoop around sort of get our bearings and where everything was and then ready for two o'clock the queues were like 50 to 60 minutes long and we managed to walk all the way up and wait maximum two minutes and that cost us 28 euros each so what about 25 pounds um so that was really really good i would definitely definitely recommend getting the fast pass tickets they we just walked past everybody and everyone was like oh, wish we got them wish we got them like you could hear them all saying it so yeah we literally walked past through everyone which is great but not then when your thighs after you've done maybe the second or third like slide 
all of our thighs were on fire like we were getting to the top and like maybe having a bit of a minor cardiac arrest like I definitely was my fitness is not where it should be so that was fun but yeah so we're gonna have another lazy day around the pool again today we're a bit late getting up for breakfast because we were a bit tired um so yeah we're gonna have a lazy day around the pool again today so there's not much filming and we will see you tonight here is tonight's little outfit so it's the exact same as the one the other night in orange but in black we've teamed it with the little strap around sandals and we're off for an engine tonight so we're gonna go up to the sunset bar now and just have a little cocktail and then hopefully i'll be able to um, actually capture the sunset for you I shut my eyes, trying not to speak, pretend that I'm dreaming. I smell your breath, not listening, but I still hear you screaming. Going under. One step away till you hear what I'm saying. Sounds like thunder. And the clouds are closing in. You see, I know this. Look at the size of our... So I've got a, what did I get? Passion fruit. And then, oh, it's not focusing. It's just on Chris's head. Megan has a strawberry daiquiri. The size of these. It's really heavy. They are heavy. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Oh, my lips so <laughs> Cheers. Really good, man. You put me eating, but it's so good. We've got Catherine here tonight and Molly. We've come to what's this place called? I forgot. Um, Mai Thai? No, that's what we're drinking. Let's call it a Thai restaurant. We're at a Thai restaurant. They've got this cute little decor inside, and we are just now waiting for the food. Okay, what did we order? So we had satay steak rather than satay chicken, and then we've got what are the got what are they golden parcel? Thai golden bag. Thai golden bag. Looks good. <laughs> okay, look at this green Thai curry, but we got it with duck rather than chicken this time. Look at that. We fly tomorrow, but like tomorrow night time. Got this cute little green number on today. And we're just gonna go get breakfast. It's a lot later tonight, but it sounds like there's some sort of like harp player. We're just gonna have another day chilled by the pool, unless we decide to go out on the um, jet skis. But I'm gonna try and keep away from that because I don't like the sea. Okay, so it's our last night. We are, I say we, Jordan's already gone to the Sunset Terrace to have a drink and get ready. I'm still in my pyjamas, but these are so cute from Sheen. I think they were literally like a fiver. So love these. I have just finished straightening my hair. I need to just put my outfit on and then I'm gonna go meet the rest of them. We are going back to the steak place that we went to on the first night, just because it was so good and I've been dreaming about that steak all over well all the way throughout the weekend weekend week so yeah we're gonna go back there so I suppose I now need to go and get ready okay so I've got ready I am wearing the pink version of Perry's bandu top I got this one in an 18 this time because the 16 it was like if I breathe out, is it going to split open? But the 16 is just a bit too big. So I feel like I need like, sorry, this is the 18. The other one's the 16. I feel like I need a 17. Um, but then I've just paired it with her white shorts as well. So I've got these in the 18 in the long. They come down a lot longer in the leg, which I love. I've just put my hair straight in a little clip. I've got two uh anklets on and then I got these little um sandal like flip-flops from Zara which are really cute 
because they just have like little detailing, like ruffled detailing, which I love. So done that. I've got a little dainty necklace on, little Fendi jute earrings. Just need to put some lippy on. We're good to go. So for the last night, we've come back to the grill place because we had to have this again. It is so good. If you come to the Empire Steak House, then this is um, fillet steak and then it's steak and ale pie. It feeds two of you. It's so big. And then we just finish it off with creamy peas, some asparagus. But this is insane. To speak, pretend that I'm dreaming. I smell your breath, not listening, but I still hear you screaming. Oh. 